Hello and welcome to Sky World Former test referee Nigel Owens reviewed some of the action from last weekend's World Cup quarterfinals. Nigel Owens gives his verdict on Etzebeth's try-saving intervention Probably one of the biggest talking points was Eben Etzebeth's try-saving intervention in South Africa's 29-28 win over hosts France in St. Denis. Early in the game and with the French already leading 7-0, the hosts were on attack and they seemed to be on their way to scoring another try before Etzebeth leapt forward and stretched out his hand to knock the ball down in an attempted intercept. The match officials ruled that the ball went backwards, which meant that the box star was saved from being penalized for a deliberate knock-on. The French were not happy with the decision and Owens shared his opinion on the whole incident. He, Etzebeth, is very, very lucky, said Owens. He goes with one hand out. There is no way he's going to catch this ball so what he tries to do, he tries to knock that ball backwards, which is legal. As long as you knock the ball backwards if he'd made contact with that ball and that ball had gone forward, then it would have been a deliberate knock-on and a pretty certain yellow card as well here. Now, when you look at this footage, there's a lot of debate about this. Some of you are saying, well, I think it's gone forward. Others are saying, no, I think it's gone backwards. It really is a very, very difficult one. It's impossible to see 100%, to put your house on it, to say if has gone forward or has it gone back. The referee looks at this and I have to say, I tend to agree with the referee here because it's very difficult to say that it has gone forward or gone back, so the referee's view and the TMO's view is that the ball went backwards or certainly didn't go clearly forward and therefore we have a play on.